and cheerleaders are the newest import to these cricket matches. Well, not to be outdone, many feminist groups uh, rebelled at the idea of women, again, walking around scantily clad, doing high kicks with pom-poms. They but they're wearing it. saris. These cheerleaders, the one out of India, in fact, there's a, a new team, uh, they're called the Pune Warriors. They have a new cheer section. They're called cheer queens, and they wear saris. <laughs> and in fact, you know, they, they put on a maroon and white sari. That's their uniform, waterproof makeup, hair extensions, and intricate forehead jewelry. And they do traditional dance forms <laughs> out on the field in multiple costumes to encapsulate India's rich 5,000-year history and diversity of cultures. And so, you know, sometimes they do this, and it's 120 degrees outside, right, because India is a hot place. And it hasn't exactly caught on yet as a trend, but I tell you what, I would love to go to a cricket match in India and see a side-by-side -side Western style cheerleaders along with Indian style sari clad cheer queens. Wouldn't that be great? Oh, it'll be wonderful. <laughs> By the way, cheerleaders here on the football, now that it'll start, they wear scantily clad and the temperature is sometimes 30 degrees, and you feel for them. You do, but you know what? They love it. They're out there, and they're doing their thing. And I think when you're in that moment enjoying the excitement, you don't care what the weather is. You're just having fun. <laughs> <laughs> Folks, coming up next is our conversation with Dr. Natwar Gandhi. He is the CFO of the District of Columbia. He's also participating in a play, an upcoming play, that's directed by Dr. Amita Jha. It's called A Tryst with Destiny, and it's about Mahatma. Gandhi. Yes. And in fact, Dr. Natwar Gandhi will be playing Mahatma Gandhi in the this other play, Gandhi. the other Gandhi. <laughs> and of course, we'll have a conversation with him as well as uh, the director of the play, Dr. Amita Jha. That's coming up next. And folks, that's about all we have for you. We sincerely hope you have a wonderful weekend. Namaste. Namaste.